People are saying that being plus size is not a choice that they make are basically saying that they have no control over what they are doing themselves. They are just spectators in their own body, helplessly, no control, just watching while their body or their subconscious is having all the control over their own behavior, at least when it comes to eating. And that is very alarming. That is a very alarming sign that there's something seriously wrong in that person's mind. Like for a healthy, especially adult individual, you should have control over what you are doing, right? So if you control what you are eating and how much you are eating, then it's 100% your own responsibility. At any point, you could just stop eating. At any point, you could reduce the calories that you are taking in and you are making the decision not to. And if you are not consciously making the decision to not do it, you are letting it happen and you're making that decision to refuse to take control. And it's by no means because you don't know better. You're being taught, you went to school and all the people in the world are telling you and there's scientific studies and so we know we know that it's true. You could just consume less calories and 100% you would lose weight. There's no physical possibility to remain that weight when you reduce the calorie intake because that would be a perpetuum mobile. That would be like saying my car is running on no gas. It's just empty tank and it's driving everywhere. That is just physically not possible. So if it's, it's alarming to me, it's shocking, it's shocking. There is some kind of mental incapacity or mental illness present in people who think that they literally cannot lose weight. It's not a choice that they can make. But if you wake up and face reality, you can make that choice at any time, but you need to make that choice at any time. Any time that you eat something, you need to make the conscious decision to stop eating before you normally would. Then you will 100% lose weight. If not, get ready for the Nobel Prize because it just overturned like 200 years worth of physics.